Hello, I'm Jenny Doe, and I'm the adopter of Luke. When Luke was five months old, he was rescued from a kill shelter. He had a broken elbow. The surgeons were prepared to do surgery on his leg when COVID shut everything down. The surgeons suggested that we wait to see if Luke um, could heal without surgery. Um, the only other option was amputation. Wendy Black from Footbridge Foundation was looking for a quiet home where Luke could recover. We had always been a dog-loving family, but after the death of our last rescue dog, we said no more. It was just too hard to lose a pet. But during COVID, I needed something to do, so I convinced my husband that a, uh, fostering a special needs dog from Footbridge Foundation was a good solution. With the carefully guided advice from the Footbridge Foundation Volunteer Veterinarians, I was able to bring Luke home in August of 2020 to begin his recovery. During the COVID lockdown, this gave me purpose. Having a dog in her home reminded us of the unconditional love that rescue dogs can bring. Luke was happy and loved everyone he met. Luke was on pain medication to help his discomfort and still had a hard time walking. He was closely monitored while his leg healed. The Footbridge Foundation volunteer veterinarians were correct when they suggested that we wait and allow the leg to heal instead of resorting to amputation. In October of 2020, the veterinarians decided that Luke was healed and ready for adoption. After caring for Luke, I knew it would break my heart to let anybody else have him. So Luke is now officially part of our family. Today, Luke is 18 months old. After limping on his leg while it healed, Luke needed physical therapy the same way a human would need physical therapy. Today, he has daily play dates with his friend Marley. Watching Luke and Marley run, you would never know that last year, Luke was limping on a broken leg. Lucas brought so much excitement and unconditional love to our quiet household.